The nation's Real ID Act is scheduled to take effect January 15th. The state is still not in compliance with the federal law, and so far the Department of Homeland Security hasn't said anything about extending the deadline again. News 13 Selena Westervelt is live in Santa Fe with the latest. Jessica, it's a deadline that's been pushed further and further back since the act was passed in 2005, but the Department of U.S. Department of Homeland Security says the law can't wait any longer, and Governor Martinez agrees. I don't want to um, pretend that that deadline isn't real. Um, I take the report of Homeland Security as serious, and that's why we're going to push forward with that law. Now, Governor Martinez has been trying to repeal the state law that grants driver's licenses to illegal immigrants since she was elected. She says that's the biggest reason why the state will not be in compliance with the federal Real ID Act when it takes effect next month. As it stands right now, New Mexicans would have to use either their passports to board planes or to get into federal facilities like Sandia National Labs. Now, the act was passed after 9-11 to prevent terrorists from obtaining fake IDs and boarding planes undetected. The state's upcoming legislative session will not be completed by the looming deadline. And Governor Martinez says if the act passed at the federal level, the state needs to do the same. And I'm hoping that since all of these legislators have just been out uh, running for office, listening to their constituents, but they will see how important it is for us to comply with the Real ID Act and get rid of the law that is our biggest impediment. And the governor has twi tried twice to repeal the law. We reached out to New Mexico's U.S. congressmen and representatives today, and in a statement, Democratic Senator Tom Udall says that he expects the deadline to once again be extended or for screening process to be implemented differently so that air travel will not be affected. Um, Congressman Steve Pierce says he's ready to help New Mexico however possible. Jessica, back to you. Okay, Selena, if the deadline sticks, airport travel wouldn't be the only thing affected. Access to national labs, military bases, and some federal buildings could be affected too.